Yo, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today I'm doing a QA and a type video because for the past like week or so I've had a sprained ankle so I have been unable to ride and plus the weather's just been absolutely crap lately. But without further ado, let's get into the questions. First I'll be answering a couple from a Q&A post I posted on Instagram ages ago and then I'll be getting into the one I posted a couple days ago. But without further ado, let's get into the questions right now. Also guys, just before we get into it, if you haven't, don't follow it already, go follow this account here at Alex Irvine Official. This is my YouTube, like, Instagram account where I will be posting everything about YouTube instead of my main account because I'd rather personalize that for my life and whatnot. But yeah, let's get jump into the first question. We got, who was your inspiration for filming and writing? Um... My inspiration for filming would probably be Ryan Williams because he's been in the game for a really long time and he's been making videos for quite a while now and inspiration for writing would probably be Cooper Kla or Swan Desi. I'm not too sure between the two but there's the answer for the first question. So the second question we got coming in is what got you to start YouTube and yet again inspiration for writing first of all already said the inspiration but what got me into YouTube I was just bored my friend Sol which you all probably know he's been in a lot of my videos up in quite a few of his videos but pretty much some of my friends are trying out the YouTube scene and I was just getting really bored at the parks and stuff did not know what to do or anything so I just decided to start filming YouTube videos for the fun of it and so I could create memories for myself to like look back on so I could not forget them because they're implanted on the internet for you guys to watch as well and with the second question we'll jump into the, um, the recent post I posted which is this post here I posted it two days ago Right there, just let it focus in for you guys real quick. And okay, so we got when did you start riding? I started riding six years ago. My first scooter was a Razor Spark scooter, that thing was a beast. And another question was when are you going to get some new learns? I got double back pegs on the scoot and got some new parts so I'll try be trying to learn five O's and some more rail combinations soon. Next question is why are you street? I'm not street, I just ride for the hell of it. Um street park, tech, doesn't really matter what you ride, I just ride for fun. But you could call me street. And when am I gonna collab with Anna Nation? And if you guys don't know who Anna Nation is Link will be down in the description. She's one of the people I ride with, one of my friends. Um, yeah, if you guys would like to see a video like that, um, maybe a game of scoop up in the cards, yes or no. You know the flow. Um, oh, that's a fresh question. Um, do you have a girlfriend? Question mark. Well, the answer to that is yes, I do have a girlfriend. Um, me and her have been dating for about three months now. And also, if you'd like to see a video with her as well, Link in the cards, well, in the cards, you know what to do. And next question. What do you think about the new 3.5 wide deck coming out? Well, my personal preference, 3.5, uh, not 3.5, 5.3 wide is way too wide. Um, 5's good, 5.2 is a bit too much. 5.3 is just insane and then they're making a six wide deck in the future coming out from Aztec not sure when that will be being dropped but six wide's just nuts but I'm not sure I don't think I'd really ride it and just letting you guys know real quick I'm just banging out these questions for you guys because it's quite late I have school starting tomorrow so yeah it's just kind of being a rush at the moment another question coming in you street bro question mark Ah, uh, no, yet again, Street Tech Park, right for fun, don't be categorized. Um, are you getting a new setup next year? If so, what's your setup going to be? Um, 
Mm. I don't really know because as you guys saw my Instagram post, I got Y bars recently, which are some flavor awakenings. Also, next vlog, which should be next week, I'll do a scooter check for you guys in the start of the vlog, just to give you a rundown of my new tarts that I have, etc., etc. But for next year's setup, um, if my Urban Art deck has not snapped, I'll be definitely getting a Paramount deck, TSI Paramount in green. I love the look of that deck. It's just like hella fine. Let's get into the next questions. Okay, so the next question coming in was what was your first pro scooter? Um, my first pro scooter was a Mad Gear 2013 Pro Edition. I had that scooter for I had the deck for three years and the wheels for three years. In fact, I still have one of those wheels that I'm running on my setup. So that that wheel's coming about three and a half years old. It's lasted me such a long time. Love the product. Mad Gear is like one of my favourite products for wheels because they've never dehubbed on me. Never. I got some Fro Fox Pros a while back, and they dehubbed within like a month. I'm not dissing on Fox Pro or anything, because I run a Fox Pro OCS, but Mad Gear wheels are just life, pretty much. Um, oh, here's another follow-up question. What is your favorite brand? You can name three. Uh, I'd have to go with Urban Art, uh, Ethic by far, and Mad yeah, Mad Gear. But yeah, in New Zealand, like, we don't really have any retailers apart from Scooter Pro or Scooter Bits. Scooter Bits is in Christchurch, which is about an hour plane, like, plane down there. And then Auckland, where Scooter Pro is, but it's an online website now. But there's not many, like, retailers in Wellington where you can get custom parts. There's this thing called Trade Me, though, where, like, you can buy parts, etc, etc. But most of the riders here ride Mad Gears or get their parts from Scooter Hut over in Australia. Um, yeah. Um, next question coming in was, what was your first custom scooter? Uh, well, I have some of the boxes here. The custom scooter is the one I'm riding at the moment, is my first one. I got the Ethic box here and the District headset in red. I've always just kept these boxes because they're pretty snazzy and I like the look of them on my like office space area. But anyways guys, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you all enjoyed. If we could smash up like 6 likes on this video, that would be very appreciated. And also drop a like on this video if you want me to film like more videos just at my desk or if you guys would prefer me out riding next week and I'll be out riding. You know the drill, 5.30 Monday, every single Monday I upload videos. If they're not on time, it's either my editor's stuffed up or YouTube's just being a pain. Yeah, it can get like that sometimes. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you on the next video whenever I post it. Peace. When we finally got down to something which the individual says he really wants to do, I will say to him, you do that. And uh, forget the money. Uh, because if you say that getting the money is the most important thing, you will spend your life completely wasting your time. You'll be doing things you don't like doing in order to go on living, that is to go on doing things you don't like doing, which is stupid. Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way.